Hi there and welcome back to the Stellaris Dev Diary number 95, the Humanoids Species Pack. Ah, so that's Christmas candy for you. What is the Humanoid Species Pack about? It's about humanoids in a species and it's about these ships here in the background. So there's a ship set too. So it's not Cherry H, it's Humanoids. It's coming for 7.99 credits. European or uh, American on the 7th of December. Your regional equivalent. So I don't know. I mean, um, if you have uh, a very low cost um, currency, might be good. Please inform me. <laughs> so um, it looks nice to me. What's in there? What's in the pack? So, um, 10 new humanoid portraits, among them also dwarves, and you can see like orcish people, uh, demons, and kind of, I don't know what they are. What are they? Tell me. And there's uh, imperial ships, as much as it looks here. So, a completely new ship set inspired by classic western sci-fi. A new city set for humanoids. That is really cool, because I always wanted a new city set for humanoids. It's just a light, tiny little detail, but when we have a, a species extra for it, why not, instead of the generic mammals one, a new city set for humanoids? And a new pre-scripted empire? I like these two. The fanatic authoritarian materialist war technocracy, with a portrait inspired by the loading screen aliens from our own official art. Interesting. And three new advisor voices. Yay, so also a small voice pack offering alternative takes on existing ethics based on the United Nations of Earth, dignified xenophile, commonwealth of man, disciplined militarist and war technocracy, ruthless materialist. Samples from each of the new voices have been attached to the bottom of this post. We'll hear them too. Uh, okay, the five already existing humanoids will remain free, available to everyone, and they are not included here. So, ten really new ones. So, you can already pre-order that thing. And... Or some screenshots. These are the ships. Looks very much Star Wars Imperial. And we have the alignment of Imaka. Von Cap, the classical Von Cap overseer of Sevasia. What is that? Nice beard. Nice beard. Is that some kind of horned ape? I really don't know, but it looks cool. And here we have the demons. And here we have. I don't know what that is. That's oh, that must be the space station, right from the from the ship set. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Got to say that looks pretty cool. So there are the wave files. That's Right, uh, uh, this one. Another war. And now I got to say, I like the war. Which one of them like you? I like the war. <laughs> the war will be the, the new voice for a playthrough. <laughs> so thank you for watching. It was a f it was fun having you here. Um, I'll add this to the dev diaries for Cherry H, the the overview post in my blog. It's in between there, but yeah. Just for the sake of completion, that you have every uh, dev diary there. It's also linked in the description below. And 
that said, uh, happy Thanksgiving to you if you're from the US where it's celebrated right now. And uh, otherwise, uh, yeah, just happy gaming to you. <laughs> See you in uh, a short while with another Dev Diary next week. Or if you're interested in that, I'm also making some some Dev Diary coverage for EU4 now. I'm interested in that too, so I'm uh, I'm going to start with that. And 1.24 uh, Dev Diary reporting has already started, so it will be interesting to catch up a bit and to see what it's about. I understand it's about Ryukyu. <laughs> we'll see about that. See you then, and have a good time until next time.